we're feeling Christmassy because it's the middle of December uh, and we've been a bit lazy to be honest. We haven't recorded an unboxing at all for December. Um, we've been saving them all up for now. So we've got some stuff to open. Uh, we should get started. I haven't brought any kind of things downstairs, right? Oh, That's a hard one to start with. Why don't you start with an easy one? Okay. Start with an easier one. Uh, while Roland's opening that, I should tell you about some of the prizes that I didn't get in the post. I won on the O2 instant winners that they did again on the priority app. And I just won a five pound gift voucher for Argos, which I may have used to get something for Roland's birthday. Yahoo! Yeah. And um, in other news, uh, Argos have been hiding falls around the UK, which are these tiny little pink creatures. And the first day that they did this promotion was in Brighton and I saw people tweeting that they'd found them in Brighton Marina. So we were down there, weren't we, for your dance class. And while I was doing a street funk class, I wandered around and this caught my eye at Brighton Marina outside Witherspoons. So I had to tweet them a photograph of me with the fool and I won a 25 pound Argos voucher, which has also been spent on something for Ryland's yes. birthday. Yeah, so that was pretty cool. Um, another cash win that I had is £5 from the Alpha Coin on Instagram. Now they give away, it's only a little prize, £5 every week, and you just have to go on and you vote on their Instagram stories, so that's worth checking out. Uh, what are you doing there, Ryke? You've finally got a prize in the box. Let's look at the so, letter. Where, where this is the letter. Okay. Congratulations, you've won our advent competition. Thanks for entering our advent calendar competition. Congrats on winning. We are delighted to enclose your prize. Merry Christmas from Mantra Jewellery. Now, I don't know what this is. What did it, you win? It, I don't know. It should be in that box. Keep going. I imagine it's a piece of jewellery. Keep looking. Has it fallen out of the box? <laughs> Oh, right. yeah, got it. Oh, wow. A small piece of jewellery that Ryland lost. Okay, yeah. so it is a necklace. Look, it's a necklace and it's a little... Oh, look, it's a little hand. There we go. That's cute. So that is a necklace from Mantra Jewellery. And I think that was the day one prize in their advent competition. Now, they do a lot of competition, so you should probably follow it? them. So, uh, well done at losing that. What do you mean, which advent was it? Which advent did you win on? The Mantra Jewellery one. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, the stickers! Why don't we put it safely in the box where it should be? Thank you. Lid? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mantra Jewelry. Stickers! <laughs> that okay. say stuff. Very inspiring. But they're, well, they're stuff. mantras. They're inspiring mantras, aren't they? Yes. The mantra Inspires. is a phrase you can live by. Right, what's next? Co op. Christmas is better together from the co op. Somehow we can do uh, this. This one was a Twitter competition uh, they had loads of prizes it was one of those where you could uh, you nominate a friend that you wanted to share the prize with and you both won the prize so it's always good to have friends to tag on twitter and instagram um so the prize is well part of it is a carrier bag wow you can't go wrong can you carrier bag and what else have we got in there be careful because you're losing things out of it again okay a leaflet um, so the enclosed gift card is for five pounds. So it's co-op. So that's it. Lovely five pound gift card. Cute. And is there anything else in there? My friend said she had something else in the box. So do check before you throw it away. Is there anything else? No. Okay, that's fine. My friend um, Christine actually she won in this competition as well. She said that she had something else. She had cinema tickets in hers, but not. Ours, we don't get cinema tickets, we just get five pound voucher. Look, never mind, that is good. Next, one. so big oh. box, big box, big black box, big black box. Okay, mm. right, right now we're going to open this. Uh, no, when you see a box like this, I don't know how to open this. there's usually an easier way to open it like that. Oh, yeah, there we go. Whoa. Mm. Whoa, so, whoa! Letter? Right, so put this down on the ground. Okay. Can you read it out? Okay. Temple Spa, congratulations on winning in a good place on our Facebook Christmas countdown competition. That's an advent competition to you. Uh, we hope you enjoy the prize. So, uh, and this is from Temple Spa Limited. 
and it was on their Facebook page and they do beautiful um, smellies, basically, so skincare, toiletries. What are they? They look like chocolates. chocolates. So first we've got two little chocolates. Well, maybe you can have those. Outside, right yeah. now. Not right now, no. Sorry. <laughs> um, maybe so later. They're, they're pretty cute. I think. Very nice, thank look you. Thank you. And then we'll I shall look at them. Something um, very important. Be careful when you open it. Keep it flat. Because I know what it... Oh, okay. Lovely. Lid off. Very, very handsome. Handsome box, isn't it? Okay. Warning. Please read the peel and read base label before you open and use. Oh, it's perfume. Okay. It's not quite... Well, it sort of is. Be careful with it. It's um, it's actually a room diffuser. So it, it is perfume, but it's perfume for a room. We've already got a couple of these. Um, oh, it's a snug bit. So it's... um. It's the diffuser jar and then the reeds that go in and let's see what it smells like. What does it smell? Kind of citrus? Yeah, I like it. it it's nice though, lovely. So that's I'm a sure nice gift, like isn't it? it? And I need to thank someone for this because again, it was one where you tag a friend and my friend Natalie tagged me. So she won the same prize. So thanks Nat. Much appreciated. Lovely. She so that's your that's sort of like a, I think I think she's probably too busy comping to watch my well, videos. She sounds she, as she, good as her. She enters loads, doesn't that? She's just won a trip to uh, Florida. Exciting. Mm. Wow. Anyway. You be mm. Right. Yes. How do we get this back together? Right. Now there's one I need to tell you about, which I won on Facebook as well. Local competition, always worth doing, uh, with the Grosvenor Casino Facebook page in Brighton. And I won a meal for four of us um, just to go to the casino and have Christmas dinner. Uh, which was nice because I took, well actually, I, I said can I take someone extra and they said that's fine. So there was five of us. I took four of the girls from the comp club and it was really good. Not doing that yet because I need to tell you about when we went to the meal, they also had a... You don't know. They had no, I'm, I'm just putting these here. Okay, they had a raffle for every group of friends that was at the thing. And I my name came out as the winner of the raffle and I won something which... I don't know if you'll, you'll want it or not, Ryland. But um, have, have a look in there. Just see what I want at the raffle at the Grove now. And I know how Ryland likes stuff at all. So, Christmas teddy! So this, so this was the prize I won at the raffle. Mm. And I thought you might like it. Oh, it's so soft. So soft. Is it good? It's got a good hat. Oh, it's really cute. Right, so, brilliant. So that's all, all those prizes. Teddy bear. Right, so the last prize I need to tell you about, which is a very exciting one, is <gasps> one um, that I won yesterday. Uh, but if I give you a bit of a backstory, uh, my lovely friend Claire, she shares loads of competitions with me, and this was one that she sent to me on Instagram. Uh, and it's Hunt the Housewives with Jet 2. And they had two of the housewives from the Real Housewives of Cheshire TV show. Um, Rachel was up in northwest of England and Dawn was down in the southeast of England. And every day for six days they were somewhere different on Instagram. And you had to make a note of the, all the places they were in. And then the first person to go and find them at shopping centre yesterday at two o'clock with all the right answers was going to win a £2,000 holiday voucher. Um, so Ryland helped me out here. We, we put our answers, we got all our answers together and we made a little Christmas card uh, with Rudolph, uh, the Jet 2 nosed reindeer on the front. And then I headed off to Lakeside after dropping Ryland at football yesterday and got there before opening time, ready to go. Um, and basically I chatted to the customer services team, tried to get a bit of insider information about where Dawn was gonna be, because she didn't say where she was gonna be in the shopping center. And they said, oh, we don't know yet. She's gonna decide when she gets here. And then, I, so I did, I, I stayed, I did a bit of work in the bar there for a bit. And then I saw two like bouncers come along and the woman at customer services said, oh, those are Dawn's bouncers. So I knew she was gonna be there soon. But then two o'clock came and went and I couldn't find her anywhere. And then I checked on her Instagram stories and she was doing a live broadcast. And I could see where she was, which shop she was in front of. She was in front of Soul Trader on the ground floor. So I rushed like a mad woman to get there first. Um, and then when I actually got there, they, the guy who was, she was with, he was so excited. He's like, oh, I missed it. Can you just do that run one more time so I can film it? And I'm like, well, I suppose so. Because I was the first person there, so I had a good feeling that I'd won. So I did the run again. She checked my answers. She said, you've won a £2,000 holiday. But not only that, the manager of the shopping centre was there. And he said, oh, and by the way, we've decided to give you a £500 into gift card as well to spend in Lakeside. Lovely. 
So that's really exciting and it was really good. And it was well worth doing. I know. And where have you decided to go? We don't know yet. No, we don't. No. Could be anywhere. Anyway, no, anyway, it's anywhere in Europe. So it's £2,000 towards a holiday anywhere in Europe and we can take it any time between March and October next year, which is perfect because that includes school holidays. So hopefully anyway. uh, we can choose that soon. Uh, but that was really exciting and a really good uh, sort of early Christmas gift. And it goes to show that if you do put the effort in, I mean, it is a lot of effort and I think your dad thought I was mad for going. Um, someone else did turn up about five minutes after me, so about 20 past two the other girl turned up and the, the manager at Into, he said she could have, um, he'll send her a gift card as well in the post. So she wasn't too disappointed, but it was really good. It was really good fun and exciting and what conference all about, to be honest. So that's, that, might, that might be it for Christmas. I have got a couple of other things. I don't know if they're going to come in the post before Christmas, but fingers crossed they will. Um, but that's it for now. See you soon. Bye. Hello, we're just doing a quick unboxing before I go out for a Christmas meal this evening because Rise had a parcel hand delivered through the letterbox, which is quite exciting. Snail mail. Literal snail mail in the post. Uh, you can probably just open it with your fingers on that one, I reckon. While you're doing that, I might prepare my parcel for opening as well. Yes. Okay. Oh dear, it's falling apart. Right. So with uh, Ryland's parcel, there is the clue of the snail, which we've already had in two previous unboxings. Snail-related prizes. What have we got in here, Ry? Mm. Why don't we have it here in the camera so people can see? There we go. Ooh. Oh, shall I open this? This is a photograph of uh, our winning entry into the competition, which was... Ryland with Things Are Looking Up Snail. Talu, they called it for short. And this was part of the Brighton Snail Space Snail Trail. Um, so what have we got here? Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Cute Christmas hat. A card. A card. And, card. and a massive pack of sweets. They, I think they're snail sweets as well. I'm sure a Susie said. Massive pack of snail sweets. Um, so it was Susie. At, I don't know how to say the name. It's Vervate. Vervate. Um, who are the company that sponsored this snail and you had to submit your photograph and then they chose their favourite and they really liked this photo of Ryland peeping it through the snail there and they said that they'd love to send him some sweets. Cool. Uh, and a hat, she did mention the hat, but we do need to take a photo because I promised I would take a photo of the prize and I wasn't sure what it was. And a Christmas card too, isn't that nice? So I think, did we win three prizes with the snails? We won the shopping voucher and the umbrella and this, didn't we? So, Happy Christmas from all of at Vivate, Vivati, Susie, Liz, and Seema. Dear Ryan, well done. Happy holiday too to you. Thank you for giving our snail things are looking up. Such a gorgeous hug and for supporting our wonderful campaign for the Martlets. Much love, enjoy the snail sweets and L Pat. Ah, oh, that's nice, isn't it? Oh, it's like that's when Ryan gets a proper prize isn't it all for all for you right it's quite sticky you can eat all those sticky yeah maybe just from my fingers i don't know <laughs> from the sweets perhaps. anyway so anyway yeah. here's my parcel uh, which ryland won't be able to enjoy i'm afraid oh no it's full of stuff messy stuff oh no hang on a minute is this have i opened up something oh, no why is it so messy this mess Oh my goodness. Oh well, at least I haven't moved it today. I have to do it tomorrow morning. Ugh, come on. Oh, I can't get it out. Oh, maybe I should have opened it at the other end. I've been a bit silly here, haven't I? Because I've opened it at the wrong end and now it's stuck. Oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> wow, that's the messiest one yet. So, here we go. This is... A star of Bombay um, gift set, which has got um, a bottle of gin in. And this is from the uh, Bombay Sapphire promotion, which is, um, it's only in Waitrose, and you need to buy the bottle of gin, uh, neck collar on, and the neck collar has got inside it a unique code, which you enter on the website. This one does end, end I think, on the 2nd of January, so there's not much time if you're watching this at the end of December. Uh, but so many prizes, um, there are, I think, um, necklaces to be worn. 
lots of these. There's bottles of martini and there's also, um, uh, what are they called, balloon, balloon glasses as well. Really good chance of winning, particularly if you do enter overnight or first thing in the morning. So if you need to get someone gin, um, then go and rush and squeeze that in before the 2nd of January. So that is a lovely prize. And that's it for today. Uh, Merry Christmas. Hello and welcome to the final unboxing of 2018. Uh, two things to do. Um, Rylan's got something to read. It's actually an email that came in this morning about a prize that's been won. So there you go. You can read the start of that. Hi, Diana. I'm the promotions executive at Toxic Magazine. I'm just writing to let you know that Rylan recently took part in one of our magazine competitions and I'm very excited to say they have been drawn as one of our lucky winners and have one of Crash Bandicoot and Sane Tril Trilogy game for Nintendo Switch. Congratulations. Lovely, that's it. That's it. So, it's a download. But we worked this out yesterday, we were on the Switch, weren't we? What is it? I've already got it on the PS4. I oh, know, but you haven't got it on the Switch. Okay. It's much easier to play on the Switch because it's a one player game and you can take the Switch to places with you, can't you? You can't take the PS4 out with you. I know. So it's good to have one player games for the Switch because then you can get on with stuff when we're on holiday and things. Um, so we just need to download that Crash Bandicoot at the Nintendo eShop, which we managed to sign up to yesterday, didn't we? Because um, Roy got a Switch earlier in the year and uh, we also got married. Christmas and Splatoon. So Mario you Party. now have you know yeah Mario Party. So now uh, we have many more games for the Switch, uh, which is good because I like it too. So yes, right. And then final prize is for me. It does say fragile on it, so let's be careful. No dropping it on the floor, as if you would. Um, that's actually I do wonder if it might only be the first or second prize we've ever had from Toxic. And we do enter their competitions quite a lot, so I think quite a lot of people must send off the entry forms for Toxic. There we go. Uh, and let's do it that way. Oh, you catch it, board. you catch it. There we go. So this is sort of to go with the prize that we opened um, last week, uh, which is, and I mentioned it, I mentioned that if you buy Bombay Sapphire, you can win Star, the Star of Bombay gift set, which we opened earlier in the video. And also, we won a second prize with this, which is a, a fancy balloon glass um, to drink gin and tonic in, which is good because we've obviously got a lot of gin to drink. So, um, that's a nice prize. As I said, it still runs to the 2nd of January, so you can rush to Waitrose and get a bottle if you want to enter. And that, I believe, brings our 2018 unboxing videos to a conclusion. So, thank you so much for watching them. Thank you for giving us a thumbs up and sharing them. I'm quite excited because Super Lucky Blog is going to be 10 years old in January. So 2019 is going to be a really exciting year. I'm going to be doing loads of competitions on the blog in January. And I've got some exciting things to tell you about that are going to happen later in 2019. So if you want to be the first to find out, make sure you are either signed up to my newsletter. I'll leave the link below or that you are a member of my Facebook group, Lucky Learners, because they are always the first people to find out about exciting stuff. So I'm wishing you all a wonderful 2019. I hope you've got some good comping resolutions. I have got a competition running for you to tell me about your favourite prize of 2018. If you tweet me about that, then you could win a £30 Amazon voucher, so don't miss out on that one. And we will see you in January. Bye! Happy New Year!